Hey everybody, so I brought you with me today to the Mimosa Market. We've been here before and this is such a fun shop to look in. They've got a million and one things to look at and I'll link their hours of operation and their address below. So I can't wait, here we go. And here's a shot around just as you first come in. And this is one of those stores that you really need to walk through two or three times just to take everything in. Oh, and you know I love the cat. And I wanted to show you this. So this cabinet is not for sale, but I just thought it was really unique. They said that that came out of an old factory. I think they had paint samples in it. Oh, I love that. And they have tons of spring and Easter decor. Oh, that bucket's pretty. Oh, and the little camper mug. And this to me looks like an old soap dish. Nine dollars. Oh, and look at these vintage glasses with the rack. Oh, and that's a fancy lamp for fourteen dollars. I thought that was a great price. And every time I come here, there's always something different. They do painted furniture here, and this is an item that was already sold, but I just wanted to show you an example of some of the things that they do. And they have tons of signs around here, so we're going to see some of those coming up. Um, I guess that's maybe a little flower pot. And here's some gold embossed lamps, and I hope you can see that's kind of a light blue color for the background. Oh, and I thought this was so cute with the old bicycle rims hanging up for decor. Oh, and a little Scotty. Oh, and the mama bulldog and her babies. Adorable. And they have clothing here. I love this top and that's $22. I thought that was a great price. And it just keeps going. Look at all this. Oh, I love that galvanized caddy, $12. Oh, and I love the bird pictures. Oh, and look at this clever tray. It looks like it's made out of old pie tins. Oh, that's pretty. Eight dollars. And look at these copper utensils. You know, that's something I really don't run across much. And they have beautiful wreaths here. $6 for the birds. Well, and they have some really pretty Myra bags here, and this one feels like a heavy canvas. And these are cute tea towels. Oh, I love that purple. <laughs> love, love it. Oh, and kind of a farmhouse vibe. And of course the bunnies. Oh, find joy in the ordinary, absolutely. That's a fancy wine rack. You know I love anything swirly. And 
these are really neat. So these are bird feeders. I'd never seen anything quite like it. So I lifted it up and I'm assuming that they've got these vases glued to the bottom so that you could put it down on a stake. I thought that was a really good idea. Pretty. You know I love the blue and white. And they have a lot of shabby chic looking items here. Oh, and look at that old picture. You know, that was someone's wedding day it looks like. I love old pictures. Here's a pretty wall planter, $10. Ooh, and look at this larger wall basket, $16. I think that'd be so pretty if you had room on your front door. And you know I love the older furniture, the vintage pieces. Oh, that's pretty with the mirror. Look at this vase. So this is made out of some type of metal and it's got the lid attached. I did not get a price on that, but I really liked that. And I thought this was so clever. So they had their business cards just sitting up on display in a tiny little chair. So they're using this old ladder as a display area. Look at the chandelier. I'm telling you, you gotta go through here two or three times just to see everything. It's so much fun. Oh, and there's a vintage rocker for $29. Oh, look at that wreath. Isn't that dreamy? and the orange. I think that says $35 and that's a ceramic vase that it's in. I love this and I thought it was a great deal. It's $28 for this footstool. Love, love, love all those colors and that was just really big and puffy. I think that's a great deal. Oh and this sweet little vase. I think that would be perfect in your bathroom. $10. Oh I thought this vase was pretty. Again, it kind of gives me that shabby chic vibe. And this on the wall is some type of canvas. And I love the country vibe with the metal trucks and they've got several of those throughout the store. This sign is so true. Today is a perfect day to be happy. Oh my gosh, this wreath is so beautiful. I love everything about it. I love the colors. I just love the combination of flowers. And here's a little wicker bag for $10. Those are always fun to carry in the summer. So here's a huge metal candelabra for $19. I think it's one of the best deals in the store. You could hang it. You could just sit it. Oh, love it. Love, love it. I want an older jug. Oh, I like that green color. And I'm assuming that's salt glazed with the texture on it. 
Oh, and here's another piece of salt glazed pottery. And I did not see a price on that. Look at these sweet babies. Oh, and the bunnies. And again, these give me that shabby chic vibe. And they actually sell paint here as well. Oh, what does that say? These are the days I never want to forget. So I like this desk. I think it would be perfect again in a guest room. It's a space saver. It's tall. It's slim. I love the chair that goes with it. So this is a Richard Genori china set from Italy. And it looks like a fairly extensive set. Of the little espresso cups. Oh, and look at this teapot. Oh, I think it's so beautiful. I love those colors. Let me see. I'm so afraid I'm going to break it. What does that say? Gold Castle, made in Japan. love these tiny little vases and this is a metal sign with Lucy on it what does it say film finished face powder say that three times fast <laughs> and this says a vintage 1976 Sears and Roebuck icebox oh and the little ceramic kitty and this picture makes me think of me. I'd be the little girl feeding her lunch to the cat. <laughs> Definitely, that would be me. I'm kind of having to climb up and hold my camera up. Can you see how beautiful this piece is? $24, and it's got that purple hue. Oh, I love, love, love that. And here's some more older dishware. You know I love the pink roses. And I think they had a fairly complete set of this. Oh, isn't that beautiful? So you got eight plates for $32. Oh, and here's some blue curtains, $29 a pair. Ooh, those are pretty. So Mimosa Market has a prayer tree up at their register, and I love it. I think it's fabulous. What they do is you have a card, you write your prayer request on it, you put it in the box, and someone comes in, and they pray over it, and they put it on the prayer tree. So I turn around, and this is so cute. These are actually scented soaps, and they look like peeps. And these earrings caught my eye. So these are spring or Easter themed. And I think some of those are possibly made out of leather. These look like they were made out of wood. I love it with the little bunny cottontails. Oh, and the flowers. And look at the little Easter egg tree. Oh, you know someone's gonna love that. Oh, what does this say? Baby, I'm crazy about you, and I'd be lying if I said that I could live this life without you. <laughs> Another shout out to my hubby. 
So I wanted to show you this antique or vintage vanity that they painted. It's the most beautiful color of blue and it comes with this metal chair and I love, love, love the peacock on the fabric. Wouldn't it be perfect if you had a room maybe in your bedroom or an extra room for makeup? open that drawer. <laughs> And here's another one of their hand painted dressers and I hope you can see it's a really a pretty deep navy blue color. To me it has a nautical vibe. And this picture is huge and look it's on sale $29. And this is the most unique lamp I think I've ever seen. So it's got the little hanging light with the elephant. And look, the little elephant charms. Again, I'm telling you, if you're looking for a unique gift or something for yourself, you're going to find it here. Pretty, $10. And you know I love the swirly metal trays. These orange dishes really caught my eye. I don't see a lot of orange on dishware and it's very almost pearlescent looking. And I think that said it was made in the Czech Republic. jar and look at that with the orange I'm drawn to orange I love it and these dish towels just say it all choose kindness and be beautiful a lot of inspiration when I go through their store. I love the way they set their table for different seasons. And you know, we talk about the mismatched dinnerware. I think this is a great example of kind of how to stack different styles of plates. Oh, and I love that floral table runner. Wouldn't it be fun to be invited to a party and they've got their table set like this? And these dishes to me have like a beach vibe. And I think those say ironstone. these light pink ones and I don't think I saw a price on those and I think those actually say ovenware oven safe oh, look how it's paired with the green oh and I love the stand it's on look at that stand and here's a shot going back through their store. So they've got a little clothing boutique. Here's an example of some of their clothing items. Just really cute summer dresses. And we saw that top earlier. And look at this cute little orange dress. $22. I think that's a great deal. And it looks good with that purse. And these older tables just, oh, take me back again. I've told you before, my grandmother had an older table like that. I can remember going to little kind of greasy spoon restaurants and they had tables like that. Oh, and look at that pink. Was pink popular, I guess, in the 50s? And I 
definitely need this t-shirt. It's fine. I'm fine. Everything's fine. <laughs> Who's had a day like that? And I think I can remember some soaps like this. So it says Vintage Avon Global Beauty Soaps. And you know I'm going to have to open it. Look at these older soaps. And they actually still had a nice fragrance. Oh, and I love the owl. And here's a little vignette they've got set up. I love, love, love those chairs. That gives me a 60s vibe. And this is going back into their coffee shop. It's called the Moo and Brew. You get ice creams or coffees or, you know, little um, pretzels or sweet treats back here. And look, I found something for your friend who has everything. You could get them a little smiling pig here. <laughs> oh, so cute. And this is an old butter mold. And I thought this was really neat. So it's a handmade mug from Costa Rica. Again, very unique. If you've got a friend that's hard to shop for, this would be the perfect shop, something different. You know, they're not gonna have anything like that. And this is going back through their coffee shop. They sell jellies and jams and pickles and, you know, just all kinds of stuff back through here. It's so much fun. It, again, feels like you've kind of stepped back in time. So I hope y'all have had fun going with me. Just again, something a little bit different. We'll be back at our restores again soon. And this is just kind of going out the way we came in. Wasn't this a fun shop? I think we could probably take two or three more laps and see something new and different. They told me that a local artist came and painted these mimosa trees on the front, very fitting for their name. Again, this is the Mimosa Market in Drexel, North Carolina, and I'll link their address below. So I wanted to showcase this sign again. It says, live a good story. We all need to live our lives like that. Live a good story. You know, don't be afraid. Take those chances. I mean, nothing crazy, but take those chances just so that you can look back and go, you know what? I did that. I have a friend that just went skydiving when she was in Hawaii. She went with her son and she had a blast. She came back showing us the pictures and it looked like so much fun so that's going to be a good story for her to tell if someone asks you what was your story what would you say you'll have to leave me a comment below thank you so much for stopping by and i hope everyone has a wonderful day until next time come go with me today bye